Some say it's too early. I say it's <laughs> just right. Chicago is preparing to deck the halls. Indeed we are as we uh, take a listen to the Vince Guaraldi trio. Oh. Yeah, Charlie Brown. This is probably the best soundtrack for any Christmas movie. You can quote me on that one. City's <laughs> official Christmas tree. That's why we're talking about this. Oh, Christmas tree. Yep, it's been chosen. It is en route downtown or about to be. And we sent Gabby over to the Logan Square neighborhood to check out the official tree for this season. Hey, Gabby. Good morning, guys. Well, things have really changed here in Logan Square. We're on Kimball Avenue. The intersection behind me is Kimball and Wrightwood, and I have the original owner. You know this trail, this tree very well. Yes. We weren't the original owners. We moved in here in 1976. My dad planted this tree. I was a little kid. I remember hanging out out here while he was digging the hole and putting it in there, and yeah, we spent a lot. Now it's going to Chicago. How does it feel to see it? you know, uproot and now be transferred onto this. Uh... I mean, it's it's a great feeling knowing that it's going to be representing Chicago. It's being donated in his name. And just, I, I know he's watching down and he's loving every minute of this. You and so many others are going to remember Jim and look at this tree this Christmas season and just feel him with you, which is so special. Uh, you've been here seeing it go way up in the air, out of yes. your old front yard and onto the street. How is that? experience been was it surprising to see how they got it onto this trailer here yeah almost a little scary i was kind of concerned for the surrounding houses but i trusted that these guys know what they're doing they do it every year so but yeah it's crazy feeling just watching this happen we have a big crowd around us uh, logan square neighbors you know what and i've heard a couple people say you know this was jim's favorite tree your dad was a big part of this community wasn't huge he? huge part huge part he everybody knew my dad everybody loved my dad everybody came to my dad for anything my dad was always willing to help somebody help anybody he was always out making friends he just he was a real just part of this community and it was always joked that he was the mayor of logan square so everybody knew they can count on him, and they knew that my dad would get stuff done if something needed to be done, take care, taken care of. So, so he was a real hero. Jerry, thank you so much for joining us during this special moment. All right, everyone at home, when you go to Millennium Park, you're going to have to think of Jim and Jerry and what they were able to give the city of Chicago here for the Christmas time. All right, I'll toss back to you. Uh, hopefully we can see the whole process a little later because we've gotten some good video of this tree way up in the air and then uh, back down on the trailer. All right, more Good Day Chicago. We'll be right back. I'll toss it to break.